Thank you so much for being here. If you like making thank you cards, you're going to love this thanks a bunch card I share. I score the middle of this thick file card to make it easy to get a crisp fold. The line I scored helped me to center my picture. I start by sketching where I want my bouquet to be so that it ends up in just the right place with my words to the side saying thanks a bunch. I plan to have seven flowers in my bouquet and I draw seven circles to help me place them evenly. I like to use a permanent pen like a Sharpie so when I erase or color, it does not smear. The dot matrix pattern on the paper helps me align my words and make sure that they are straight. Each flower in the bouquet starts with a small circle in the middle and then has five petals around the outside. You could personalize this card by drawing tulips or roses or somebody's favorite flower instead. I love to draw these cute and sweet little five petaled flowers because they are a classic. I drew the vase with a little bit of a curve on each of the lines to make it look elegant and realistic. One parallel line at the top of the vase gives it just enough detail. Because I started by drawing the flowers and not the stems, I have space to add some pretty greenery. I like to fill in the space with these pretty little branches that have a leaf right at the top and leaves alternating down each side of the stem. These don't need to be exactly evenly spaced and I just draw one branch, look at my picture and see where the next place is where I think it could use some filling in. Then I start to think about the flowers and where the stems would be coming down so I don't have any flowers that are just floating in the air. After drawing in the stems and making a few minor adjustments, I have a pretty nice draft of a face full of flowers. Before I color my picture in, I use a very soft eraser to remove all of the pencil marks that I left on the page. I color in my flowers with a bright pink Crayola and I use a light colored green on the leaves. These are the same pencils I've been using for a really long time and they do a nice job. When I'm done coloring what I already drew, I will check again to see if there are spaces to fill in and I will add a little bit of a side picture of a flower to show that there are some behind as well. I finished my picture with a Tiffany blue for the vase and then it will be ready to give to a special person I want to say thank you to. I also want to say thank you to you. I'm glad that you spent this time with me and I look forward to seeing you again soon. Thanks a bunch.